why would a U.S. taxpayer open a UBS account in Switzerland when it could bank with UBS right here in the United States? Why would 19,000 U.S. clients with nearly $18 billion in assets choose to open up accounts in Switzerland? It seems plain that part of the answer is that they wanted to open undeclared accounts that the, U that the IRS would not know about. They wanted secrecy, and UBS gave them secrecy. Quote, information on the whereabouts of Heinrich Kieber should be passed on to the National Police Force of the Principality of Liechtenstein. Many powerful financial key players in Liechtenstein established smaller banks or trust companies whose names nobody recognized. They have transferred their risky group of clients into those new banks or trust companies. In that way, if the risky clients are exposed in a scandal overseas, the larger, well-known banks or trust companies are out of trouble and the media spotlight. The HD Trust, but not so much the HD Bank, did not accept new clients from Russia, for example, but would refer them to such smaller trust companies. Global Wealth Management and Business Banking of Zurich, Switzerland. I am here to make absolutely clear that UBS genuinely regrets any compliance failures that may have occurred. We will take responsibility for them. We will not seek to minimize them. On behalf of UBS, I am apologizing. I am committing to you that we will take the actions necessary to see that this does not happen again. Shannon Marsh of Fort Lauderdale, Florida, and William Wu of Forest Hills, New York. We appreciate your traveling here today. Truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth, so help you God. I decline to answer the question based on my right to remain silent under the Fifth Amendment to the United States Constitution. In 1992, LGT helped Harvey Greenfield establish a Liechtenstein Foundation.